Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Saturday. It's the 27th um, and yeah, it's already 20 past 12. I'm blurry and I've got my hands full. <laughs> Let me try and do this. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, hopefully that might be a bit better because um, I have to press the button on like the focus button on top of the camera. Anyway, it's Saturday, it's 20 past 12. I've got an order that I'm going to be sending out. I've got money that I've got to put back in the bank. So a trip over to the post office. It's raining. <laughs> it's a lot cooler today. A lot, lot cooler. So that's really nice. Uh, but I'm going to my sister's today, spend a couple of hours over there. Um, yeah, so I just thought I'd quickly come on and say hello, good morning, good day, whatever. <laughs> and I'll catch you up throughout the day. No, cheesy no. toes, oh, cheesy it, toes. Cheeky, 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 cheeky boy. Cheeky, cheeky, cheeky boy. Cheeky, cheeky, cheeky boy. Tickle, 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 Stevie Peggy's. <coughs> Look at the state of you. Here's Mikey playing with his favourite toy, Charles the Hoover. <laughs> And his other favourite toy, his toy hoover. <laughs> and uh, washing machine. So I think we're going to have a clean freak when uh, Mike is a bit older. But as I met my sisters and uh, been here for a little while. Um, but Ollie is just so cute. You cutie boy. Cutie cutie. Cutie cutie boy. Cutie cutie. Pussycat. Yeah. yeah. At least it's a lot cooler today. Uh, my sister, as you know, has got a pool in the garden. She's got uh, some inflatables. And I went in the kitchen to look out the, the window. And the inflatables are just lifting up. Because <laughs> it's windy. So we've put some of them down. Um, so yeah, this is the annoying noise that, that Hoover makes. I wonder who bought in that toy. I did. <laughs> On Christmas Day, or was it Boxing Day or whatever it was? Day. Oh my God, that Hoover went on all day, and then the batteries ran out, and he cried until we put new batteries in it. <laughs> um, but he's playing with Charles at the moment. Good evening guys, I've just got home from Casey's and I've had a really lovely day actually. Um, the boys were really, really good. Um, other than uh, my mum dropping out of the cupboard, a glass oven dish. Oh my goodness, it fell from, like it was on the bottom cupboard um, and it fell out, the, like slid out of the, the cupboard and just smashed into a billion if not more pieces literally it exploded when it hit the floor um it actually fell on my mum's foot and where some of it had broken um it broke into tiny weeny little bits and a couple of bits were quite big and i think as it's fallen sort of on one edge and then the rest has fallen on her foot she's cut her foot um so she's probably got like a centimetre slice out of her foot or into her foot and it's like it's like a talky cut oof it's horrible um but <laughs> i was um i was having dinner at my mum's we had uh, ham egg and chips um and i was cutting the rolls and my mum was doing the chips and i think she wanted to get a dish out to put chips in to keep warm to put in the oven 
Anyway, I was on one side of the kitchen cutting rolls. Casey and the boys um, actually popped out in the car to go and pick my cup. So lucky enough the boys wasn't there or the boys weren't there. Um, and my dad was in the living room. So me and my mum were in the kitchen and this almighty explosion happened. And my dad screamed, don't move, don't move. He was like, all right, all right. And he just looked and he went, oh my God, please do not move. Do not move a single millimetre. So he was like, all right, all right. He didn't have no shoes on and he looked down and it even went into the living room. Um, so I didn't have shoes on. My mum didn't have shoes on. And uh, yeah, so lucky enough where I was standing, the broom was so I could sort of sweep a path to my mum to pick up the big bits of glass I put them in a carrier bag and my dad went and got um, my mum some flip flops and today my mum bought my dad some new sliders for Spain and he just went put them on <laughs> they were miles too big but I managed to put them on and managed to sort and I, when I put my foot uh, in one of the sliders there must have been glass in the bottom of my foot because as I've trod down I just went ah and it was like the tiniest weeny little shard of glass um it was really painful and I just took my foot back out and I said to my dad this glass this glass and um he managed to get the glass out of my foot I didn't bleed or anything it was literally it must have just been sort of pressing on the skin so it didn't draw blood um and then we were just sort of trying to sweep up the glass. Um, thank thankfully, once we'd put shoes on, um, we could walk around a little bit, obviously being cautious. But my mum's foot was bleeding everywhere. It was all over the floor. It was all in her flip-flop. Um, it was just bleeding so bad. So we finally managed to sweep up the kitchen. My dad hoovered the carpet in the, or the rug in the front room. And he was just like, oh my God, it's all the way over here, which was right by the sofa. And um, so he hoovered the whole living room. Uh, we moved chairs out of the way and um, hoovered in there. Then we hoovered the whole kitchen, moved the stuff out of like next to the fridge. There's like a fruit, vegetable stand thing. Um, and hoovered the whole of that and then my dad went round with just the pole of the hoover and went round the edges with that we were still finding glass um casey came home and we was just like can you take the boys straight upstairs like there's glass everywhere mum's bleeding everywhere um it was all over the kitchen floor and we had dinner literally on the go um so my mum had to take the beans off the side she took the took the um, oil for the eggs off um, the chips were already in the chip pan uh, so yeah it was a little bit hectic in that in those it was probably about 15 minutes um, and yeah I'm just grateful that my mum's okay her foot did stop bleeding um, but she did go upstairs and Casey was trying to help her I was cleaning downstairs and Casey was helping to clean her foot upstairs um and she said the blood just went everywhere it was just would not stop they ran it under the shower um and it did stop eventually put a plaster on it but it did still bleed a little bit after that as well and i think that's because my mum was trying to finish co cooking dinner um and then it just started bleeding again but hopefully fingers crossed all the glass was picked up and found um but it literally tiny weeny 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 little shards it was just it was like the thing exploded it really was and it just went everywhere and I just looked I was like oh my god and the way my dad screamed I've never heard him scream like that obviously because he didn't want us to hurt ourselves um because we both didn't have shoes on and when he was like you've both not got shoes on well we didn't think we was gonna drop the dish um but he, luckily enough, he helped us sort of get our shoes and help us tidy up. And I was sort of kneeling down, picking up the big bits, putting it in a bag and that. Oh, God. It was just sort of a bit crazy. <laughs> um, Ian's gone with Bills to pick up a car. The original one didn't 
go through or whatever like it was it, it fell through um and then they're going to see a couple more today and then i think he uh, he has actually bought one and they're on their way back but he will be a couple of hours so um i'm just going to watch jan live i know that a few people have put videos up today um but i'm going to watch jan live for a little while oh maybe she's not live it's not coming up I will have to have a look. I don't know what happened. This is where I, found the perfect I think it might be working now. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna watch Jan for live for a little while and um, do some crafting. I don't know what yet, but we shall see. Um, I obviously had dinner. It's ten to ten already, and look at the sky. It's still really light out. I love it. I love bright evenings and nights um even though it makes it it doesn't make me tired enough to go to bed if that makes sense like in the winter by nine o'clock i'm sort of ready to go to bed because it's been dark for so many hours um but i love I, sometimes i even love getting into bed and it's light out i don't know I might be weird. Um, I've rambled on for seven minutes. I apologise. I hope you enjoyed seeing the boys today. Um, they were so good. So, so good. And, yeah. Anyway, uh, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Um, here's Jan live. I don't know how well that will work with the screen. It might work okay. Uh, I've turned the volume down. <laughs> but there's Jan live. So every Saturday night... Uh, at night, 7 o'clock she does a live and her channel is Jan Carruthers if you're interested she's a lovely lovely lady and yeah she's just so, so lovely anyway I'm going to go and stop rambling and I shall see you all tomorrow bye